What's up, guys? This is Oblivion Guy finally with some Modern Warfare 3 commentary. Uh, sorry I didn't record last week. I was very, very busy. But, you know, it's all good now. Now, this video is going to be about my first impressions and. Yeah, basically my first impressions. So, what do I think of the game? Well, it's way, way better than Black Ops, I gotta say. Hit detection is very accurate. The kill streaks are ranged to. For a lot of players, you know, some people play the objectives but are afraid to get buzz killed. You know, your support type, no problem. Specialists are for people who want to go one man army, and just go ballistic on everybody, like I'm trying to do right here. And overall, I like it. The weapons, they really, they really did good with the weapons, and I'll definitely be able to do some let's puts with these sets. The the match types, I love them. Kill confirmed is a great way, in my opinion, to level up fast. But the maps, uh, that's where we run into some problems. Because the maps aren't really good for an AC-130 or like a Reaper. Uh, except for this one. Hardhat is actually okay. But I didn't decide to run the Assault type, which is why I didn't really do as well as I thought I could have. But I think I did pretty well just for running Specialist. But during this match, I encounter two things. And it's not the fact that people are whoring in the tunnels like they usually do on Hardhat. It's the buddy system. Now, most of you guys who play Call of Duty know what the buddy system is. When you see two or three people running together and then getting the jump on you, and you can only kill either one or, if you're lucky enough, both. But these guys, they didn't... They, were, they did it. They did the buddy system a couple times on me, but... But overall, it failed. It backfired on them. It failed and it backfired on them because buddy systems usually count for like two people. Search and destroy isn't common for the buddy system because that gets too destructive. Maps like this have the buddy system, and as you can see by the kill feed, the buddy system just backfired. So you know, it does. It does help us anyway. I really, really want to keep playing this game. This is really, this is a really good game. I recommend it to anybody who loves first-person shooters or who just wants to have fun. You know, it's way better with friends. I got to tell you that much. When you play with friends, you have so much fun. Playing solo, it's okay, but you'll get, you know, I don't want to say you get tired of it because Modern Warfare 3, you don't really get tired of Modern Warfare 3. You get tired of maybe doing the same thing but you won't get tired of the game itself I mean if not then just go play spec ops honestly which I gotta say they toned it down a lot compared to Modern Warfare 2 in Modern Warfare 2 when you did spec ops you needed a buddy to help you with most of the missions I mean they have two missions where they force you to find somebody but overall it's okay it's not like it's not really really hard it's just a little tedious you know and again the buddy system please stop if you know the buddy system that's good like the optic optic uses the buddy system but they know how to work with it like they're all snipers so they know how to back each other up if you're running if uh, if two of your friends are running and gunning you're gonna die you know I don't know why you decide I don't know who in the group decided to do that like they probably needed to be a little more coordinated than that so you know Opinions, Modern Warfare 3, it's good. Theater mode, oh yeah, I forgot to mention theater mode. Theater mode is good. It's basically as if you were there. You know, like Black Ops, you can kind of tell, like with the lag and stuff, but Modern Warfare 3 does have similar things in theater mode. But when you show the like, final kill cam, that's good because, you know, a lot of people want the spotlight. Oh, pro tip. Ballistic vests will save your life. If you see a ballistic vest somewhere, pick it up, please. Recommend it highly. It will save you. And there's going to be an example in about a couple of seconds. Like, there was this dude over there. He was sniping. He shot me, and then I got the kill on him because I had the ballistic vest. So, pretty nice. Pretty nice. Then I stopped the sound horror because, you know, I don't want to die. I like surviving, you know. And all in all, if you don't have this game yet, I highly recommend go get it. Have fun. And that's the end of the match. 
and then they're gonna show the final kill cam which puts one of my comrades in the spotlight I didn't do so bad running specialist 